Hey everyone, Michael Martin from Yahoo Esports here, and I am joined by Uncle Valle. Alex Valle, how you doing? Uh, doing fantastic, dude. What's up with you? Uh, well, I'm enjoying all of this action at yeah. EVO 2016. Yeah. We just saw some really juicy matches. Yes. Uh, but let's talk about you for a second. How'd your weekend go so far? Uh, weekend went great. You know, uh, I went in with Rashid, and a lot of people just didn't really have faith in that character. I stuck it out. There's still so much to learn, and you know, I'm here on day two and I went pretty far. I mean, I think uh, a lot of these guys are now, you know, really checking out the matchup because this character, he doesn't really do much damage, but he can rush you down pretty hard. Uh, oh, we, we know you like that rush down. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, absolutely, brother. I did catch uh, uh, some snippets of some of your matches earlier. Uh, you know, you were playing some Rashid. Obviously, you play Ryu, longtime Ryu player. Um, you know, talk to me a little bit about how you feel in your matchups with both of those characters, I don't know, when you feel like you, maybe you have to switch back and forth or, or, or make that decision. Yeah, sure. Uh, so my strategy was to come in full force with Rashid. I'm very comfortable with all of his bad matchups, right? It's a matter if it's a matter of uh, you understand the Rashid matchup. And if you know how to space away and how to get out, how to V-reversal properly, and I see that you're doing that, and you kind of beat me down, then I'm gonna pick Ryu because, I mean, I, Ryu is not really my strongest right now. It's Rashid, and the whole and the whole reason for that is because I don't know what everybody does yet. The game is fairly new. He he's he's definitely one of the best characters in the game. Uh, but if you reach a certain echelon, just like the, no, I'm serious because he's got all the tools, but it's only a sprinkle of Ryu players make doing work, right? Because they know how hard how how much of a struggle it is. So I just stuck with Rashid, and I played my like Chai Rithi plays uh, Chun Li. I, I I beat him. I think uh, Mika is a really hard match, but I beat Nando. But then, like, oh my God, it's Andre took me out with Mika. But I, you, you know, got Mika. A, yeah, I did get Mika. But uh, and then Cami, another bad matchup for Rashid. Uh, it was Shao Hai that put me into losers the first time. So that's why I went Ryu. And I think like you know Ryu Cami, pretty pretty good, pretty fair match. So um, I did bring it to the last game, but I couldn't clutch it out. Xiao Hai is a pretty legit player right now. Yeah, he is, you know, and uh, even the last time I played him at Evo, it was close, you know, so it's like, I'm right there with those guys. I'm, I'm, I'm there. It's, it's a little bit more time, a little more, you know, more feel of the game because now they're playing my game. It's not Street Fighter 4 anymore where they can hide behind vortexes and focus out. Now they're playing like, all right, you know, I have to respect the button that he's pushing out. So it's, so it's, a, little, it's a little different, you know. So speaking of Ryu, uh, you've been putting in some time, helping out another uh, fellow SoCal player, Wednesday Night Fight, uh, Daryl Snake Eyes Lewis. Talk to me a little bit about that. He won the last Wednesday Night Fights, right? Yes. Uh, talk to me a little bit about that, uh, putting in some work with Ryu, and I, I know he, 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 bu he busted him out this weekend. How, how'd that go? Yeah, uh, he was always interested in playing Ryu. He just needed some time. and. When he was taking him out at like uh, Vanguard and even at CEO, he didn't seem confident. So like we went to the lab together to like find out what's it gonna take for him to play Street Fighter V Ryu, not an uncertain type of Ryu. So he's now the way that he's playing him is very setup based. He knows what to push versus normal recovery versus back recovery. He knows safe jumps. He knows uh, when to switch to Zengi because where he's comfortable at. Like, we have similar strategies. Like, if they know the Zengi matchup, he's gonna pick Ryu, right? And Ryu, he plays a really smooth style. Uh, a little bit, a little bit kind of like me, a little rushdown, but very, he reacts a lot better. He like, <laughs> react, yeah, his reaction time is ridiculous. Those young man reactions. Yeah, he's got them young man reactions, and he won Wednesday Night Fights. He played mainly Ryu on day one, and uh, he played Ryu a couple times here, but uh, Zengi was the clutch the clutch pick uh, throughout his top 32 performance so far. Yeah, because he did That's beat cool. Punko with yeah. Zengi. Yes, yes, Punko, he beat Mago with Zengi. Uh, and uh, yeah, and those were like titans to climb to get to this R. And they're, they're about to start, uh, start top 32, so this is gonna be sick. Yeah, yeah. incredible. Yeah. Um, any last words, any any last thoughts about uh, so, you know this idea of, I guess, having some I don't know, backup characters. You know, Street Fighter 4 was sort of like a, it got to the counter pick game kind of thing, but uh, for the most part, I think we're seeing a lot of players with, you know, sticking with one character, and as the game's evolving, now we're seeing, well, maybe 
I should pick up another character, and you described a little bit this idea of sort of switching back and forth tempo, reading what your opponent's going to do. Uh, I don't know, any thoughts to players who may be struggling and are thinking about, well, maybe I should pick up a different character. What, what's the mentality there? Uh, well, first you got to master your characters. Right? I don't know, what, what is that? I think that's MK. <laughs> Probably. So, you, you, a lot of players that are like kind of struggling right now, you probably haven't mastered your character yet, right? Uh, but you understand that, you know, there's a certain, there's a limit to what you can do right now with that character. There might be another character that can overcome these obstacles. And you know what? If it comes to that point, try it out. Try it out. Play f five different characters. And say, all right, is this, is it a rushdown problem, defense problem? Is it a neutral game problem? Find what ticks. Find what's making you plateau, and then give that character some like some love as a backup for that archetype of player, right? So. Real quick, yeah. you want to plug Wednesday Night Fights? Oh, sure, man. Hey, uh, if you guys want to watch some of the best SoCal players, Street Fighter V and various other titles, check out Wednesday Night Fights every Wednesday, 9.30 on uh, twitch.tv slash level up live. If they're in the area, where do they go? They go to downtown Santa Ana, California at the Esports Arena. Check it out every Wednesday. You'll see me there. I've been there. It's a fantastic venue. It's a great event. Uncle Valle, thank you so much. Oh, yeah. I'm Michael Martin, and this is Yahoo Esports.